Hey guys, thank you for joining us once again. I am RPG Outdoors Robert and this is Angela. We are going to bring you guys two more kayaks to review. We're going to go over them and they are the new canoe. We have the Frontier 12 and the Flint. So we're going to come in a little bit closer and show you guys some features of these boats and uh, we're going to try to maybe beat the sunlight and uh, get in the water back here and show you guys the stability on some of these. So you guys come on in. of mount which will go in further detail with that on the other kayak um, you can also mount in your wheel system to um, carry your kayak um, you have a handle here for carrying we have a compartment here that is an o-ring seal and you open it up for storage uh, we have a tracking system right here um, which we'll get more into depth with that as we go up to the front you have four rod holders. Um, when they're not in use, you can seal them. That way you don't get water in there. There are two hooks on each side if you want to bungee cord to put your, um, if you have a yak crate or any of your um, boxes for your goodies. All right, the Big Comfy Seat is also on the Freedom Track system. You can move it back or forward. You have your ring strap that you can put your boxes in. Um, you have your scupper holes and your veins that go into the scupper holes to allow water to get out easier if it gets in. Um, this scupper hole can also double as your cup holder. Up front here, you have this other strap that holds your hog trough for if you're doing tournaments. Okay, this whole weight is 63 pounds and it has a capacity of 375 pounds. Okay, up front you have rock holders where the tips go in so they can go back. And then you have a super duper sturdy handle for the front. Alright guys, second we have the upgraded model if you don't want the, uh, the smaller boat, if you're ready to upgrade to something a little bit wider. I want you guys to see this boat. This boat is the widest boat that we have had yet to see. And I'm gonna give you guys some dimensions. This is a 12 foot long Frontier 12. It holds a maximum of 650 pounds and it also can boat up to two people at once. It has the same tracking system as the Flint, but you can actually add two seats on this. You can hunt off of this model. And we have on this one, what they call the 360 swivel. So you can actually be sitting sideways on your favorite duck hole and hunt off of this thing as well. We've got the stability bar here that is fully adjustable on the fly. All these accessories can be added and they will be with us at the Expo Center. So you guys be sure and check us out to see these and give a feel for them. It has a full range of motion here. Simple lock and it's locked in that easy. And it's also on the tracking system, so you can move this further up, further down, and adjust your seat to your accessories. All right, guys, on the back of this boat, what makes this new canoe unique? I want to show you guys these very sturdy, it's a thick transom. This thing's about two, two and a half inches thick. 
it has a hole in here and this hole is made because new canoe makes their own truck system with tires it's in a 90 degree l shape it looks something like this up here i'm going to put a picture of it and it simply just slides in the back with a pin there's no straps there's no hassle easy on easy off not only that you can add a plate that is separate with accessories that allows you to mount a two and a half horse outboard motor on this and it's going to make you getting to your hole a little bit easy if you use this thing for hunting it's perfect because you don't have to muscle with the pedal system or paddling you can always use your uh, transom and your outboard motor not only that we have a great drain sensor right here it's a plug it also has a o-ring seal on it made to last we have a nice carry handle with a corded here so it's not uh, going to be any rubber or anything that's going to eventually get uh, deteriorated by the sun or anything like that very sturdy great on this all right guys on this new canoe on this frontier we have actually rigged out semi we have it, it we have not the pedal system or the outboard system on it but we wanted to show you guys some of the accessories that you can get this is the new canoe crate here as you can see we have three rod holders and this comes unassembled and you can easily assemble this it comes with a hinged box very spacious not only that it's made of the same material that the canoe is made of so it's very thick as you can see very durable and it comes with these straps that you can mount to the freedom system all right guys on this boat we're gonna have only two scupper holes and this thing actually comes with two scupper plugs you'll see it attached to the back here and they're simple press in and pull out they come with a nice little lanyard so that you don't lose them and it's just two plugs simple as that the seating system on this as you can see before I said it had the 360 so this seat will turn a full 360 degrees if you have the paddle system on it, they actually offer a locking 360 seat. Now this seat is also going to be easily moved around by the Freedom Track System. We have track system from the back starting for the crate all the way to the front for all your accessories. We're going to have paddle ring straps on both sides. As you can see here, you put your paddle on and you strap it over and this is going to hold your paddles. You have two nice sturdy straps for carrying and pulling and you also have two cup holders with the ring straps here so these things will adjust to any size cup that you have to put in here there's two on both sides these models actually come with these foam inserts we had to add these and they come according to the color that you purchase so um, it's an easy installation it's a peel and stick you just got to clean it up a little bit very very easy to do aesthetically it looks really good and on the front of this we have a small dashboard if you see here we mounted our fish finder we have a roller lock. Now these are just options that you can get on any boat. These aren't the options that you have to have, but we just wanna show you guys what you can get on this. You can actually add this. This will hold your hog trough. It will hold two more rods to keep them sturdy out of your way for you fly fishermen. You can take this rod, put it up here at the top so you can run your fly rod all the way down to the end and uh, keep it completely out of the way. At the very front, we have another handle two rod tip holders you slide your rod tips in here so that you don't get them banged up caught on any sticks whatnot that you find on the water and last but not least we have one large compartment here that has a waterproof seal all the way around and this thing actually has a liner on the inside so you can add any uh, valuables or anything that you may not want to get wet this will aid in keeping those things dry so these are just a few options that we can get on this kayak. I really hope you guys get a feel for this. Uh, we may run out of daylight. I don't know if we'll be able to put them on the water and give you guys a picture of the stability. But I wanted you guys to get a feel for these. If you want to see both of these models and the Pursuit model, we have three of these. We'll be at the Expo Center January 25th, 26th, 27th. And we'll have a... Uh, demo models that you guys can actually jump on these and come check them out you may think that this is not stable enough for you you may want a bigger model smaller model we have all sorts and types come see us let us outfit you with a new canoe today and hopefully this will be your new boat we'll see you guys on the next episode